Hello friends, how are you? My name is Krista Deary. Oh, and I just love you guys so much. I love your leader. She's one of my favorite people on the planet. I learned so much from her and I'm so inspired by her. And I love your team. I love y'all's culture, just all the things. So it's such an honor to pop on really quick and congratulate all of you, senior golds and above, that earned this retreat. I really believe this will be a pivotal point in your journey. This will be something you'll look back on and you'll be so grateful, not only that you qualified for it, but that you are there experiencing it as well. I think back to when I was a senior gold Ruby, senior Ruby, those were such crucial days, especially the senior gold rank for whatever reason. It was the first time I got stuck actually, or stable. <laughs> the first time I felt a stall in my business was at senior gold. But it was in that season that I wrestled with the Lord, that I wrestled with myself and really made a decision that this was the vehicle God had brought us to for such a time as this. This was what our what was going to make our dreams come true. This is what we are going to put all our eggs in one basket for to see Chad come home and be a full-time dad, to see the dreams that had been birthed in our heart years and years ago, to see them come to pass. And so here we are today. Because of that decision that we made at Senior Gold, here we are now living the life that we had dreamed of. Now, is it like so glamorous and lifestyles of the rich and famous? No, I have eight kids, you know? It's like, it's changing diapers, it's homeschooling, it's crazy, but it's freedom. We just got done traveling for three weeks and I had people messaging me like, what about school? I'm like, what about school? We'll do it later. I live for freedom. <laughs> and so traveling and we've been discussing having a second home. Like we are discussing things that were once like pie in the sky dreams. And here we are walking in it and living it today. And I believe the same is gonna happen for you. So right now I just wanted to say a quick prayer over y'all. Can I do that? To pray over you as you close out this time together, but really to pray over what is next and what is to come. Father God, I just thank you for each one represented here and for the work that they put in to qualify for this, the grit that they've already shown, the leadership that they already encompass. But I thank you, Lord, for divine strategies for what's next in their season, that you will come alongside them and empower them and gird them up with the strength and the boldness that's needed to step into all the plans that you have for their lives. We thank you, Lord, that you've brought us all here to this place, to this company, to these teams for such a time as this, because the plan on this is so much greater than what we will experience and what we will get out of it. But you are so aware that this isn't about us. It's about the people that will come after us and the impact and that ripple effect that will be made. We love you, Lord, and we praise you for what you're doing. In Jesus' name, amen. Well, I love you guys. I'm so proud of you. Press in and go home with something in your heart stirring where the Lord is impressing on you. This is what is next. And then go after your dreams harder than you ever have before. Pinpoint your fears and do them right away so they no longer have a hold on you. Pinpoint what you're avoiding and go ahead and get it done because usually it's exactly what you're avoiding that will unlock the key to take you to the next season and the next stage and the next breakthrough. Keep pinpointing those things that you're pushing off, burying deep, avoiding, and that's exactly what you need to be doing. And each time you do that, your comfort zone will expand and your dreams will become reality. I love y'all. We'll see you soon.